tastes pretty dang good. Threw <laughs> up. That thing is nasty. Dylan, we're here for another burger review. We're at Burger Grilled Right BGR, which, as far as I can tell, is a Maryland chain that is in five, six different states. We got one here in Salt Lake. We're here in Sugar House. Okay. Let us get to this thing. I got the Wellington. the Wellington. Okay, so black truffles, mojo sauce, and some blue cheese on there. Looks like some mushrooms. That's significantly better than I thought that was gonna be. So that's medium, it's a little pink for medium, but at least I didn't like overcook it. There's a straight medium rare in there, man. I usually don't like medium rare with this thick there's a patty. It tends to not taste that great uh, on the inside. It tastes a little bit better when it's cooked a little bit more all the way through, but this one is actually not, not doing bad. You see that pink on the brioche? That's from the hemoglobin. So this is Wagyu beef. Wagyu is that fatty kind of cut of beef. If you watch my other reviews, you know that I have a love-hate relationship with Wagyu. I usually like more fat on a meat, usually kind of helps it taste better. We did a burger review at Cubby's and they use a sirloin that didn't have enough fat on it, so it took away from the taste a little bit. Wagyu, though, it tends to have too much fat in it and it takes away from the taste of the beef. That's kind of what we're getting here. Not as tasty as it could be. It still tastes pretty dang good and it makes the beef taste way better than the beef should taste. Uh, I can't get any of the blue cheese on there at all. So really, this is about the sauce itself and the mushrooms are kind of good, but it's mostly about the sauce over the beef, uh, which is okay. But if the beef tasted better, then like this thing could be, this thing could be killer, man. This one right here, solid seven two. All right, I'm out. I'm hopping on here. I had a, Whew, doing wow. Right. You doing okay there, man? I don't know. I took a bite of that, I almost threw <laughs> up. That thing is nasty. Here's the deal. Dylan is not used to black truffle, and while I said that you can't taste any of it, you can taste a little tiny bit of it, just not a ton. Again, I'm used to black truffle though, because I go to Italy and I eat it all the time. And if you're not used to black truffle and you don't like the taste, it is extraordinarily off-putting, and it seems to be that way for Dylan. I give that a point four. <laughs> <laughs> a point four? Yeah. That's Official little, cameraman that's little, review. That's a little harsh. No, but. that was disgusting. <laughs> no way I'm eating that again. All right, I'm out. Hey, if you like this content, you want to see more reviews, do them every day because I want you to know where to go for really good burgers here in Utah and beyond. Subscribe. There'll be a couple videos up there, and we'll see you next time. Thanks.